Hello, welcome back Dismantle and Future Displaced fans. So let's see what the tip is. Oh, Arthur, smile. There's still a lot of work to do. I wish you could teleport. I mean, they could have introduced a tower over here on the map so you could directly teleport onto the other maps. I guess that would have made the game a little too easy, maybe too convenient for us, right? Arcturus is probably this one over here. I have a big part of it uncovered. Maybe this area is playable, I don't know. Maybe there are some... something that I can interact with to get to the rest of this thing over here. Okay, so Link Tower. Close. Will freeze. Beaver Point. <laughs> That's a good name for it. Oh, it's all the way to the north, okay. This is well install everything. Yeah. I guess at some point I'll make another video where I just show you all of the things that I have uncovered in the map, the pets, yeah. Probably I still have a few more videos to make up after I finish the DLC. Uh, so Let's go for that buried treasure first of all because I'm really curious if there are some items that are much more useful. Yeah, this game has immense potential, so I guess that's why they made the displays. But sadly, I was on the forum and asked a little bit about the game, and it seems like they haven't really started working on displays. It's actually scheduled for release in 2025, so not even next year. Anyway, I'll probably make another video to share more details on this place because it's a wonderful game, a wonderful project. I just told the developers to play Night of the Dead and just copy all of the mechanics of that game into this place. It'd be amazing either way. The hyena barks? It doesn't... Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> but I guess it's cheaper to not record that sound effect. Okay, so what is this? Combat or... Puzzles. It's puzzles. That's a lot of pew pew pews. Okay. You look terrible. Actually, it's not that terrible because there are not as many skulls as I thought. Oh, I was not looking at that. Wow, okay, this is kind of complicated. I don't like it. I'm too lazy to pull out the whistle game. Give me a break. Come on, game. Don't make me pull out the whistle. Thank you. Well, I guess... Okay, let's, let's be logical about this. We can only move that so we can move here. Cannot do anything over there. What would be the point? I'm not sure. Why? How? What? I don't understand this one because unless you're supposed to push it like this, but then what? Yeah, I cannot go further than this. Hmm, this is so weird. I guess we need to put one of the blocks over there. Game, what did I tell you? No whistles. What is the trick here? I guess the trick is it's randomized. <laughs> okay. Okay, I guess you can make a mini game out of this single thing uh, as well. So I guess you have to go slow. Okay, go slow. It's obvious I need to put a block here, but what block can I put here? It doesn't make any sense. I need to put that over there. I have no idea how this works. I guess you have to put it like this, but how do you get... Oh. 
I think I understand now. This is probably the worst one yet. Just because it's not about puzzles, logic, combat or anything. It's just about... Come on, why does it have to be so frustrating? I really don't understand why developers don't play their own games. Do they think this is funny dying and all this have having to put up your whistle and replace all of your items? I spend so much time switching these things, it's almost impossible to play and have fun sometimes. Why couldn't they put the stupid pole doors in the entrance? Why could they? Why did they put it over here so I have to use the whistle so I have to waste more time? It's kind of annoying. Hmm. Wait. That was not the plan. Yeah, I cannot move it back. Okay. Well. I'm a bit afraid of this because it seems like it's really... Why, why is it this one over here? Looks like this is very easy to mess up and die. Okay, this was actually... Kind of hard Very and annoying. Good. Well done. I got a golden retriever. Woof. Yeah, this might have been the harder one because you don't really understand that and you also have to dodge those bullets. Okay, next thing, please. That was not fun. <laughs> The Golden Retriever experience from fishing and fishing speed. Well, I guess it's a good pet to have around when you're fishing. The hyena is probably the biggest animal. It looks like it is. Okay, what's the next stage? Please don't be as annoying as that one. Close to all. I guess it's just better to teleport over here. Most form is over here. Hmm, I still have to pick some bridges. Wow, I still have to work a lot on this map. I'm not seeing the tower. Where is the tower? No, okay. Where is the tower? Oh, it's all the way over here. I forgot about this. They still haven't fixed this bug. But now I see that. Okay, so the teleporter is to be blamed for the for the bug with the cinematic cannot be interrupted. Okay, keep calm, calm. That was only the first one. Oh, it's all the way over there. I guess it's always going to be in a very secluded place. Lower Pumpkin Station. <laughs> I, I read that as Lower Pumpkin Station the first time. This is the area where we fought the boss, if I remember correctly. Well... I'm too lazy to go around there. Good boy. I think this is the coldest area in the game. And uh, what? Oh, I could have just went over there. That was not such a. That was not so far away. Wait, where am I going? Is it on the hill? 
Let's see this. Okay, let's not break the pipe anymore, just because we need to go here. This is a little trickier, I guess. We have to use the rift, maybe. I don't actually remember how to get with, on top of this thing. I don't know if I was on top of it. Okay, I guess we just have to use the rift at some point. Let's go through here. And I think this will lead us anywhere now. I guess they put some of the later stuff in much harder to reach places and the challenges are much harder as well. You can clearly see this is supposed to be kind of like mid-game maybe. How do I get on top of this thing? Is that a possible way over there? I don't think so. Yeah, let's go to that drift over there. Maybe that's the clue we need. Oh well, experimenting. I guess at some point you'll just have to unlock everything on the map, otherwise you'll be in trouble. I'd said I'd make more resources. I hope I'll not run out of resources. I guess this is one way to reach it. That's a different bar. Ouch, I died. I wanted to see what's on... No, no, it will teleport me over here. I wanted to see what's in the house. It might be a recipe for something. Might be interesting to search that one as well. Yeah, the camera angles kill me more often than anything. I guess we should recover our stuff. I thought I could skip this. This will definitely be a recipe for cooking, right? Ah, uh, no. Huh, I guess it was nothing interesting. I had so many zombies on top of this place. Are we okay? I guess we're interrupting the the pet hunting for a while. Yeah, see this this is why I'm so upset about this Smith mechanic. It's just exactly what I need. To equip this thing over here and now I have to go back all the way to the base and come back and I don't know it's a, it's so annoying I hope they fix this at some point well I guess it doesn't really matter because I'll not be playing the game when they fix it and I'll not need to use this mechanic in particular I mean I'm still hoarding as you can see it's impossible not to hoard in this game I want all of the loot Is this house just had a lot of good loot, a ruined cliffside house. Then we're just back over here. Okay, that was actually interesting. This game was filled with secrets and pathways and all of all sorts of cool stuff. Yeah, I hope they keep the same mechanics for this place, okay. Let's see if, he, if this will be a little more interesting. 50 minutes and I only did one. I 
hate this. Oh no, I hate this. Okay. The camera angles are messing with me. Yeah, it's... It's not fun. The camera angles are the only problem with this type of a challenge. Wait, what? Okay, that was Fantastic it. Fantastic job. You're a star. Succulent sardines. Pet melee damage plus two. <laughs> okay, that was not as bad as I thought it would be. Next, please. I guess I need to cook that. I wish we could cook over here. Fifty-three percent complete. That's not bad. I'm close. Sunburn desert. <laughs> I like that it's the frost one, but it's sunburn desert. Guess we should go over here, cook this. So six fishes, four fishes, three of them and two of these guys, okay? <laughs> Succulent sardines, that actually sounds delicious, I would go for some sardines right now. I'm a bit hungry. Wait, didn't we complete Sunburn Desert already? Is that correct? I, maybe I read that wrong. Uh, 895 really they but how no that means there are two of them oh okay so i don't have to do anything else so if there are two in the same region that means you can just go and collect them yeah, okay that's that makes sense it's easier this way i thought i would have to install another Another transmitter on the tower, but no, you just come over here and... Oh, it's the baby deer. I don't like it when it's... Yep, um... yeah. I don't remember the key for targeting stuff. It's supposed to be middle mouse button or something, but it doesn't... Unequip the target, if that makes sense. I guess it would be one of those challenges where I have to... Not a fan of these, not a very big fan of these, because it just means you'll have to die two times, three times until you understand the mechanic behind them. Or the correct route. That's it? Why? You are. Why was this one so short? Compact heading down with the Terrain Spirit Lancashire Healer. Okay, this was the easiest one and it's so short I guess you are supposed to take it slower and you'll die a lot of times because you take it slower. <laughs> Not me. No, oh, looks like I have to go cactus farming at some point. Material drop 25%. Man, this is clearly an, a DLC that is supposed to be played from the beginning of the game because this would be massive. Material drops 25% extra. You would get so many rewards from this. Okay, and um, two more. Westport. Okay, let's go to friendly Westport. I don't. I don't even remember where that is. I guess it's in the west. <laughs> Bingo. Okay. 
Това спорт е тези. Спорт е за един от моите фаворити ерия с The Luxurious Villa over there, The Farm, The City Side Estate, The Port. Не, аз ще го изучавам много повече. Това е само от други ерия. О, не имам нищо да инсталирам на това. Campfire Triangulation, perfect. Okay, so it was over here. Oh, it's quite far away. Well, I imagine people that don't have this many materials or are not as far into the game will have a lot more problems reaching the locations themselves. That was very noisy. Hey dog, show me the location. The bug. Uh, let's get out of the area and let's come back. Oh, okay, that was weird. I thought it bugged out because the dog was not showing me the location. I guess if something dies on top of it and you have the signal installed, that could be a problem. I don't know. I don't understand why they make you do it like this because and just switching the menus and going into that. I just don't have the patience anymore to do stuff like this, which is just time consuming. Hey, dog. <laughs> I guess this means I have to be a lot more careful. I guess now they're really piling up the puzzles on me. Wait. How do I get out of here? What am I missing? Much faster than the other ones. It's so risky. Okay, cool, but now what? I guess you have to push this back over here so we can pass. I guess you can also try to dodge roll through it. <sighs> oh, what am I doing? Not patient. Wait, what is my goal now? I need to be over here, but how? I really don't like this. It's so 
I need to throw a bone over there. Fantastic job. You're a star. Holy. Okay. Yeah, the puzzles are getting much harder. Well, I guess some people will be happy about that. <laughs> If you love a good puzzle game, this is for you then. I guess we just teleport all over the place now. What did they give me? Not back strength. Oh, look at this. This one is beautiful. I guess all of them are beautiful, but the Kuli has such a majestic look to it. Serpents crossing, oh no, I don't like the temple stuff. You'll see why, you'll see why. Which was... This one, right? Right. Hey, I keep forgetting about this. I remember how fun it was to explore this place because it was the only place in the game that seemed like it was out of the ordinary with the serpent's cross with many monsters and actually a lot more difficulty than the other areas until this point. And you had to fix the bridges otherwise you, can, you couldn't pass through many areas. Cool. Very cool area. So... Over here, right, right. I think this might be the longest or the most time consuming DLC. If, if you're not this advanced in the game, you probably need 20, 30, 40 hours to get all of the pets. Even so, it's going to be annoying. Just because you need to have full control of these areas. Combat is not a problem, the issue will be traveling all over the place. I guess the zombies don't care anymore. Yeah, look at how... No, no yelling at me. Yeah, let's destroy this so we can see where we are going. When I arrived here, it definitely like a place it would be a secret area. Yeah, the problem is you got you get all of these materials and there's nowhere to deposit them. I have to go all the way home to deposit them and then change whatever. I guess it doesn't matter that much, but it's super annoying that you cannot do that. Or if you have to do that. Come on, stupid dog. Okay, probably have to push the dog onto this thing. Uh, this is not going to be fun. Is it changing? Well, how do you want me to do this game? I guess you have to die once. Hope the lever doesn't reset it. Reset. I hate you, game. Why would you do something like this? That means. No, it, it's annoying. Also, the colors are weird in that area. You basically have to travel super slow so you don't mess up the other bricks when you're passing through it, okay? Okay. Barf Special? Why is it called Barf Special? I guess it's just more pet raw damage. 
Which I guess at some point will stack up so much you'll be able to kill most of the enemies with your pet only. Hey. I guess your pet will get super strong. To the point where you don't even need to fight anymore. Eh, yeah, I really want to go home. What? Oh, I entered the portal immediately. Okay. We have to rest a little bit as well. Oh. Good the dog. But special. I guess it would be very appetizing for the dogs, but not for me. For the cats, maybe. And I think that was it. Now I just need to enter the final puzzle area. Which will teleport us to the island. And now, like I said, I'll just complete the island stuff after. Arctic, Arctic workers retreat. But for now, I'll just focus on getting the key. Probably the tower to a certain degree. Huh, that's a lot of bones. Bones and, bones and chips, my favorite. I guess you have to destroy all of this if you don't have the lockpick. Workers of Arctic Workers Retreat, your resilience in the face of adversity is commendable. Together, we ensure that even in the cold, pets find warmth and love. I guess all of this was done to improve the relations of the human with the pets. Or no, I think the workers are supposed to work in these harsh conditions. The rest of all the fatigue sleep depriving in the warm desert as a spike. Yeah. And they're just forced to work in very, very bad conditions and they just gave them pets so they feel better. <laughs> and well, in reality, that doesn't help as much. As much as we'd like to admit it, I guess the pets don't help in every condition. More like a prison than a camp. Good dog. Mm, the kitchen, my favorite place in the game. Potato, fish pie. Mm. This is just making me very hungry. I don't actually want to destroy any of this because it looks so cool. Well, I guess I can do some. Some indoor stuff. <laughs> So many chairs, everyone was just having their lunch, their coffee, their hot cocoa in front of the TV. Preserving the animals and the environment. Bulldogs don't look like that. No, that dog, bad, bad dog. Doing not a bone. Okay, let's find a fireplace or something. Oh, I guess I don't even need to come to this place. Oh well. I just like what the developers did with the wall building and of course the mechanics. Oh, so that was a C grave letter. Okay, so I guess we have to find the keys at some point. Uh, the letters at some point. It's driving me crazy that I cannot deposit this stuff and I have to constantly just change the teleporter to one or the other with. I guess it's better than just going to the fireplace like I used to do, but still. 
could have made it so you... I don't know, have an extra slot for the teleporter. I guess if you want some of the extra loot I will be getting here. Not that I needed what I wanted. This is that's just a lot more spices. I don't believe in blocked doors in there. Dog, no. Not everything, some of it. Why not stash the key down there? Hmm, interesting clue. So let's activate the tower while we're here. Finally, okay. Yeah, I guess so. No matter how hard I try, these episodes will not be shorter than what 40 minutes. Just because of the puzzles and some, some of the traveling, it's so weird. The sonar. Can file triangulation. I don't need to install the scanner radar, but I just like to fill in all of the slots. Oh no, what did I kill? Oopsie, what did. Man, that was auto targeting that it's worst. Oh. Okay, I didn't see anything. We didn't see anything. We just killed a few zombies. I have the hauling that that these cold areas have. Gun, interesting. That does that stand enemy for a while. Okay, so we have a new gun, it's a dart gun. Huh. Makes sense. Yeah. They're just giving me a lot of bones in case I didn't have enough to make the all of the pets. Don't. Don't jump into the water, that's not a good idea. We still haven't learned to swim. Yeah, our GPS took us to a very sh weird shortcut. Oh, we can find some of the flowers on the other parts of the island, okay. I thought we can only find them in that DLC area, but I guess they're all over the place now. They're all over the place, but not really all over the place. I guess it's still worth searching because they're giving some of the rarer things. Prostarium Bridge key. Self planks. Well. Wait, where does this bridge lead me? Apparently nowhere. Interesting. Okay, so this just leads us over here. Uh, yeah, let's go and... 
No, let's go home first. Let me craft the dart again. I guess it's easy to craft, but probably it will be hard to upgrade. Let's upgrade some of the stuff so I get rid of it. A wooden iron, that's not bad. Lumber and scrap that. Okay, so it doesn't increase his damage, it just increases his number of uses. Let me guess, mana shard and titanium. Well. Uh, next time. Probably a very cool weapon. Come on game, let me do it. <laughs> what was that? It sounds so weird. I don't think we can find zombies. I think I installed the towers all over the place and I cannot see any enemies. Well, probably over here we have some enemies. I hope so. They just die instantly because even though it's not a lot of damage with my perks it is a lot of damage. I guess it doesn't last that long. I guess this is supposed to be more like a feature, not an actual mechanic to kill enemies. I guess it makes sense, more or less. Wait, what was that bear trap? Forget about it. Okay, so we can catch the monsters. I don't know, it's a lot of these things that have been so cool to have in the beginning of the game. 63% complete. Wait, I forgot to get the key? What the hell? I did get this key, right? I picked up the key, right? Why does it say 2 out of 4? That's bad. That's really bad. Um, I, I guess you can play a little more. I think I need to go back there. Stadium area. Then pick up the key. Wait, that would be terrible if I forgot to pick it up. Oh, come on, game, stop doing that. Doesn't matter. I hope I didn't forget to pick up the key, that would be a big, big mistake. Maybe I did forget because I was focused on other things all the time. No, it looks like I picked up the key. I'm sure it was there, but it doesn't appear on my quest log. Well, that's discouraging. I'll have to look at the recording again to see what happened to the key, but anyway, see you next time. Bye-bye.